Welcome to History Adventuring. This is episode number 67. I'm Brad Hall, and today we're going to a drive-in liquor store in the 1960s in Phoenix, Arizona. When I first moved to Phoenix in the 1970s as a teenager, I didn't pay much attention to liquor stores. I hadn't paid much attention to them as a kid in Minnesota either, and the fact that there was a drive-in liquor store near where I lived didn't impress me at all. By the way, this picture, which is from the Duke University site, is from the 1960s. It is at 40th Street and Indian School Road in Phoenix. The city of Phoenix grew up with cars, so it's not surprising that there were a lot of drive-ins, including theaters, restaurants, and even churches. Phoenicians like their cars, and can you blame them? The temperatures get into the hundreds in the summers, and being out in those wide open spaces with the sun burning down on you is very unpleasant, I know. I drove a car that broke down a lot, and I did a fair amount of walking. Okay, let's see. We're time traveling to the 1960s in Phoenix, Arizona, and you mentioned that you wanted me to pick up some Ham's beer, since apparently you're from the land of sky blue waters too. Me, I just want some soda pop and candy. Maybe a Barks root beer? Or a Pepsi? Look, we can get a bag of ice cubes for a penny with a minimum purchase. I'll pay for that. This has been History Adventuring. I'll talk to you later.